Hey, Joey. What oh, you... hi, Professor Berger. What are you doing? Oh, I am taking notes on all the things I saw out the window with these binoculars here. Oh, what did you see? Well, I saw seven woodpeckers and eight partridges. You know, but what I really, really want to know is how many birds I saw all together. Oh, hey, well, I can help you with that because I actually have a math riddle about two friends that is exactly that same question. Well, that'll help me a lot. Show me. Okay, I would love to. So here's the challenge for us. Karen has seven ones. Jimmy has eight ones. They put all their ones together. And here's our challenge. What number did they make? I don't know. That's what I'm trying to figure out. Exactly. So they're confused, too. So let's think about it. So remember, Karen has seven ones, and Jimmy has eight ones. So let's first of all see Karen's ones. I'm going to bring them in one at a time because, of course, they're ones. We'll model them with connecting blocks. And now I want you to help me count. Are you ready? Okay. Okay, I'm going to bring them in one at a time. All right. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven. That's it. And that's Karen. Seven. Great. And now I'll do Jimmy. So Jimmy has eight. And let's see if I can do Jimmy. So there's one. There's two. There's three. There's four. There's five. There's six. There's seven. And there is the eight. Mm-hmm. You see? So there they all are. Now, okay. here's what we're going to do. We want to look at them and find out how many there are all together. Right. So what I'm going to use is my favorite thing, the 10 frame, to help me. That's my favorite, too. (laughs) Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to start by putting all of Karen's ones inside the 10 frame. So let's see what happens. So I'm just going to put Karen's ones in here one at a time. You're good at that. I am very good at that. And now there they all are. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to put in Jimmy's ones in the leftover spots and see what happens, okay? Sure. So now I'm going to kind of stick in some Jimmy stuff. And so here we go. So Uh Uh-oh, I'm out of room. (gasps) I filled up the 10 frame, and these are all the stuff that are extra, you see? Here's all the extra stuff. So now we have to think about this. This is a little tricky because I've got this extra stuff here. So... What number do we have? Well, if I fill up a 10 frame, what do I get? You get 10. Exactly. And let's see how much extra we have. So if we start with 10, what's the number that comes after 10? 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. That's exactly right. And so the answer, in fact, is... (laughs) 15, and there I wrote out 15. And there's another way of thinking about 15. There is? Yeah, because you just saw it here. It's uh, a 10 plus how many of these guys? A 10 frame plus 5. That's right. So it's 10 plus 5. That's another way of saying 15. Oh, wow. And there's another way of saying it. Because, really? Yeah, because we have just one 10 frame, so that's mm-hmm. one 10. Right, and right how there. many ones do we have? Five. So another way of saying it is one, ten, five, five ones. Five ones. Exactly. So 15, <sighs> cool. 10 plus five, one, ten, five ones. It's all the same thing. And here's the really, really cool thing, Joey. Uh, what? We didn't have to put Karen's in first. We could have actually put in Jimmy's first. So let me show you really, really fast something I think you're going to find really cool. I'm going to throw all of this stuff over to the side. Whoop, just make it disappear. And let's try it. Let's try it again. But first, I want you to think about what would happen if we used Jimmy first and then put in Karen's. Think about it. Well, did you think about it? Well, let's see what we get. So first of all, we have to start off with Karen's seven. And so here, Karen's seven. Mm -hmm. And now we're going to have Jimmy's eight. So here's Jimmy's eight again. Right. So we're going to do the same thing again. And now here's my ever popular... Ten frame! Exactly. But now we're going to do Jimmy first. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to do Karen... With anything left over. So here we go. So Jimmy first. So I'm going to put him in. Okay. So now it all's in. 
And now I have some extra space here in my 10 frame, so I'll start to put Karens in. So I'm putting oh. Karens in. Oh, but look, just like before, we have extra stuff. We have stuff. leftovers. We have extra stuff, and I'm going to put the extra stuff down right here. And now let's see we, what we get when we do Jimmy first and then Karen. Well, we have a full 10 frame. That's 10. And then how many extra down here do we have? Did One, we... two, three, four, five. Exactly. So it's still 10 plus five, which five. is... 15. Right. And again, we see it's one, ten, and five ones. Yeah. So all together, Karen and Jimmy have 15 bucks. That's so the answer is 15. So now I come back to you, Joey. Right. And knowing everything you now know, how many birds in all did you see? Well, I saw seven woodpeckers and eight partridges. Mm-hmm. So, all told. Uh, so that was 15. Oh, wait, 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 though. Or was it eight partridges and seven woodpeckers? Or was it, I don't know, I, I, did I even see woodpeckers? Well, maybe I saw the same woodpecker twice. Now, and Joey. Then, and if it was flying around, you're being so silly. Seven or Have fun with math. I, we'll I see you soon. I thought you said you saw woodpeckers. Well, now I'm not sure because it was more.